Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we are going to help you to determine the Lewis structure of XeCl4. It's a chemical formula of xenon tetrachloride. For that, let us count the total number of valence electrons. We have one xenon atom having eight valence electrons and four chlorine atoms having seven valence electrons. Now that gives us a total of 36 valence electrons. Now for the arrangement of atoms, we will put xenon atom in the center and arrange chlorine atoms around it somewhat like this. And to show a bond, we will place pair of electrons in between each atoms. This way, we have used a total of 8 electrons and we are still left with 28 more electrons. If you see, chlorine atom needs 6 more electrons for complete octet. So we will assign 6 to each of chlorine atom and by doing so, we will be using up total of 28 electrons and we are still left with 4 more. Xenon can expand its octet and can hold more than 8 valence electrons and so we will assign it remaining 4 electrons. All the atoms has complete octet in this Lewis structure. Let us calculate the formal charge of each atom just to confirm that this is the best possible Lewis structure. For xenon, we have 8 valence electrons minus 4 non-bonding electrons minus 8 divided by 2 that gives us 0 formal charge. For chlorine, we have 7 valence electrons minus 6 non-bonding electrons minus 2 bonding electrons divided by 2 that gives us a formal charge of 0. Each atom in this molecule has 0 formal charge and thus we can say that this is the final Lewis structure of XeCl4. For more such videos, make sure to subscribe our channel and thank you for watching.